this video is going to be super short and a super quick application of uh, just how I do my top and my bottom fake lashes because you guys have requested it. So the lashes I'm going to be using are the Dark Swan of Denmark in the style Adore and you can trim them to fit your eye if you want. These fit pretty well for me so I didn't but just clip them. But the glue I'm going to be using is a Duo Lash Adhesive which is my favorite glue. I've tried so many, this will always be my fave. And I'm just applying the glue and then dipping the little part where the glue comes out and I'm just applying it with the side. You can do the glue straight on but I'm always just so scared that I'm going to get the glue everywhere so I don't. But after I'm pretty much just placing the lash as close as I can to my lash line and then don't worry about the inner corner and the outer corner because you can always just press them on with tweezers or with your fingers whatever. So that's what I'm trying to do right now with the tweezers. So you just kind of pull them and push them around until everything is nice and glued on and that's really it for the lashes. That's how I do my top lashes. It is so easy once you get a hang of it and once the lashes already fit your eye then it's just super easy. For my bottom lashes, I'm going to be using these True Lashes, the brand is called True Lashes, <laughs> and it's just like some random top lashes, I don't even know the style, but I pretty much trim them to just get like three lashes, and then after I bend them just so they fit my eye better, because bottom lashes are kind of hard to fit. Then I'm dipping it in glue and make sure you have mascara on because that helps so much when applying bottom lashes. It helps them blend in and it also helps them kind of figure out where you're trying to place them, you know? So I'm using tweezers and this is a little bit of a trickier process but you pretty much just have to wait until the middle is glued on and then you can manipulate the inner and the outer kind of portion of the lashes. So you just kind of play around with it and get them on as close as you can and then you can trim them also. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't but to blend them better you can trim them. So that's what I'm doing. That's really it. That's how I do the top and bottom. This was so highly requested, so I just wanted to do like a really, really quick video. But I hope this helped you guys, and that's it. I'll see you guys next time with a longer video. Bye!